Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, I'm going to introduce you and myself to a new brand out there called Furry Sports. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so my new buddy, Ed, from Furry Sports contacted me about a month ago and said, hey, big fan, got a new product out, new company out, wanna try some stuff? I'm like, hey, what you got? You know, and he explained to me, um, the founders of the company called Furry, F-U-R-I, Furry Sports, and they made rackets, they made clothes, they made grips. And I'm like, I looked them up online. We chatted. I'm like, yeah, send them over. I'd love to try them. So month later, this box came. Actually, I just got it. So looks like some kind of designer thing, actually. This is kind of what I expect to get when uh, I'm getting some high ticket item. You know what I'm saying? Maybe they're a high ticket company. But I haven't looked in here yet. I know I've cut it open just so I'm going to cut some time off from this video. But. Whoa. But. Okay. All right. Let's take a look. Oh, look at this. It's a sweatshirt. It's actually a nice sweatshirt. It's a really nice sweatshirt. Look at the back. This is the back. Little toolkit thing. Check it out. Furry sports. We don't play. Looks like we got overgrips in the yellow. Overgrips in the black. All right, so love black envelopes. Oh, it's string. Cool. Stickers. Oh, and a note here. It says, Hi, Tennis Spin. We are big fans of your platform. In close, you will find the Oh, the rackets, um, perfect. And four polyester strings, two packs of our overgrips, furry hoodie and marketing material. We look forward to your feedback. Oh, that's awesome. Let's check out the sticks here. Armalite. Let's go sideways on this way. So it's all black frame, yellow, and a little bit of orange trim on here. Hmm, interesting. 101 square inches, it says. On that one. Ooh, I like this one. I can feel more weight. It's a matte finish on this one. And then let's check on the side here. Check it out here. It's like the New York skyline. Because they're based in New York. So nice. I'm, I'm liking the weight on this a little more. All right. Excited to check it out. So we're going to string these up and we'll see you on the court. All right. So we're on the court. We got the Fury rackets in the light and in the regular. They're called Arma Pro. It was Arma Light. Arma Light. Got my man Coach Goo.
All right, so we just got off the court with the Fury Rackets. I'm going to let Coach Goop go first to talk about the light, and then we're going to come back and talk about the pro. Coach Goop. Uh, overall, I mean, Fury, this is the Arma Light. Actually plays really well. Um, I love how they finished the racket. Let's first talk about the cosmetics out the way. I like the, actually love the cosmetics. Um, definitely like the city line, the sky, skyline in there of New York City, I assume. Um, but overall, it plays really well. It reminds me of a pure drive of the Babylon family. It has a lot of pop. Uh, definitely a lot stiffer than most of the beams. Um, but it actually provides great feel. Um, surprisingly, it de delivers the power, but the feel's there too, which is pretty it's not as common as you think it would be with stiff rackets but this actually has a ton of feel um easy to maneuver with um definitely felt like i can get around with the racket pretty easily um uh, but yeah and then with this head rack this head size it's a 101 so which is i was really shocked by i usually don't like 100 rackets um but a 101 it actually surprisingly plays really well and easy to maneuver around I like this light. The recipe for this light is actually, I don't want to say perfect, but real damn close to being perfect for a racket of this weight. So it's about 10.1 ounces before strings. It plays a little heavier than that. Um, as great feel. I don't normally go with a 10.1 ounce racket for myself, but um, the feel is definitely there with a ton more lead I could probably use this racket I'm talking a ton more lead though but and I've done that in the past I've taken a light racket and weighed it up because I just like the way it feels and this is kind of like one of those rackets that I like the way um, it feels so I feel like the recipe is almost perfect for this racket so liking it a lot I'm gonna ask coach Goo to come back so for the fury pro Pro, Arma Pro, go Arma for it. Um, so this is a little heavier. This is a 10.8 ounce racket, which is a 305 gram. Um, same spec, 16 by 19. Um, same head size, 101. Overall, I mean, I like a little weight. As you guys can tell, I love to put lead on my rackets. Um, but overall, I mean, this plays really well. I was really shocked with it. Surprising, it's a 101. It's like almost, if I had to compare this, it's like the Wilson Blade Pro Stock version of the Serena Williams. Mm. A little bit. It has a little influence of that. Even though it has a big head size, it definitely does plow through. Um, I think definitely easy to maneuver still with this racket because of the weight change, but easy to maneuver, great feel, great pop. Um, honestly, definitely super surprised with this racket overall. All right, switch. All right. All right, pro. I would definitely consider playing with this racket. I don't say that very much, as you guys all know. I definitely know that for a fact. <laughs> and I, so plowed through perfectly, had definitely good weight at the head. It kind of feels like a controllable burn to me. That makes sense. I can see that. Yeah, V4 controllable burn. Uh, I like it because it's nice and, well, it's stiffer than... Um, Actually, it's stiffer than a Clash. It's, it's stiffer. I think it's stiffer. Bring it in. Yeah, bring it in. Bring it in. Bring it in. I think it's as almost as stiff as a Babylon, but I think it's even a bit stiffer than that. But it's got better feel than it has a Babylon. better feel. Though. Yeah, it does yes. have better feel on both brackets, actually. Yeah. So I would categorize this as a slightly controllable burn. So I, I and I do like that. You guys know burn was my racket for. Long three time. years yeah so version one version two mm -hmm. all you that's right so so it's right down my alley um hey man replacement they did a great job with this uh easy yeah. plow easy feel um let's let's switch to the strings a little bit here yep we use the strings that they provided us which is called c4 c4 <laughs> okay i like to do my um Rush hour, rush, rush hour thing, thing. See, foe, right? Like, you know, explosives, you know what I'm saying? So, and the ball did explode off of this string. Mm -hmm, I was pleasantly shocked. 
And it felt great too. Yeah. It felt really good. Good feel, good explosion, good spin. Good snap Nice back. snap, exactly. Yeah. The only thing I didn't like was I had to keep taking these uh, okay, dampers off. Okay, that's just you, off. man. Don't worry about it. That's just you. <laughs> he likes the dead I don't feel. Mind, I don't he mind like, dampeners. He likes you know? dead. I hate dampeners. So I kept having to take it off and put it in my pocket. But no, I mean, um, you know what it reminds me of actually, the string? Poly Rev. Yes, it looks like Poly it Rev. It looks like Poly too. Rev. It looks like the first version of the Poly Rev. A little stiffer. A yes, little stiffer. a little stiffer than that. I think it holds tension pretty well, surprisingly. Yeah. In my opinion, it still holds really nice tension. Definitely. So I'm, I'm actually going to keep using this if you keep if you guys see me keep using this in future videos that means he likes it a lot yeah so you don't switch we'll that see. much we'll hey see. man you're wilson diehard so we'll if see. you do switch over to this i'm gonna be shocked i know that it's it's gonna be shocking guys it's gonna be shocking maybe t end of 2022 let's talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> let's talk about the overgrip so oh, yes so the overgrip felt like my favorite overgrip which is the, the Dunlop. Dunlop. Super tack. It actually had peeling off both sides like a banana too. Um, nice and thick and durable. Yep. Very nice tacky tack. too. Yeah. yeah. Perfect tack. So Fury actually. They're legit, man. Very legit. Somebody's doing a lot of research. Somebody's doing a lot of development. Somebody's using their brain and you know, listening to people which is, I think, lost in this world sometimes when it comes to tennis rackets. Mm. Wow. You know what I mean. Okay, All right. Boy. Okay, we All get right. you. I want to thank my man, Coach Goo, who talks a lot too, but he listens. He knows. All right. Coach Goo, where can we find you? You can find me AGs at tennis. I'll also be posting content there as well. All right. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.